Fox Sports. Believe it. Panasonic Ideas for Life. Catch, Catch water, water polo on Fox Sports. Uh, my name is Kenneth, and I was from ACJC last time, and right now I'm in my first year in chemical engineering. Yeah, hi, uh, my name is Chris. Yeah, I was actually from TVJC previously, first year economics. Yeah. Yeah, um, Marcus from RJC last time. Um, yeah, now um, vice cap. He's vice cap as well and captain. Yeah, so first year in mathematics. Yeah. Uh, hi, my name is Siteng. You can call me Sit. I'm the uh, NUS captain for the women's team. Uh, I'm currently a year one student that uh, doing psychology at NUS FASS. Yeah, hi, I'm uh, Amanda. Uh, life science major. Uh, I played water polo since I was sec, sec one, yeah, mm -hmm. and all the way until now. So that would be SCCA, yeah, correct. So that would be like eight years, nine, nine years, nine, nine years. years. Yeah. Um, actually, I'm different. Yeah, I actually only started this year, so it's my first year playing water polo. I was actually swimming more often previously. So upon entering NUS, no, I thought I'd try a team sport. You know, they were pretty picked yeah picked up in the NUS. Um, a little more on the competitive side, yeah. So how often do you and your team train? Um, right now we are training five times a week from Monday to Friday. Uh, Monday, Wednesdays and Fridays are at uh, the CCA branch at Kukitima. And Tuesday, Thursday we are training here at the... Uh, I was actually a swimmer before this, so uh, I got a bit tired of like just swimming laps and laps and laps. So I um, decided, you know, if you do it with a ball, it'll be something more interesting. So yeah, and my friend was actually in um, the national women's team, so she brought me along for the first training and I got addicted ever since. Uh, I'm not actually a swimmer, so I'm from SAJC and SA has uh, their own uh, water polo girls team. So uh, I was just very interested into it and yeah, it's something new, so I joined. So it was straight away water polo? Yeah, no yeah, no. But you had competitive swimming. Yep. Uh, of course, definitely there is, cause the guys they can swim faster, but the girls they are they don't swim so fast. Actually, it's like more or less the same, but we use more of the scratching and grabbing <laughs> and pulling and everything. <laughs> yeah. Violent is in a different form. Yeah, correct. Okay, so um, how often do you and your team train? Uh, we're currently actually training every. Uh, every day of the week except Wednesday and Saturday. Yeah, and we have uh, land. Okay, for NUS training, as in just the school team, it's actually Tuesday, Thursdays, and we have a bit of land training before that. Uh, for extra swimming sessions, we have. Early this year, actually, we won the NUS Great Eastern uh, Water Polo Challenge. Uh, we're actually the defending champions uh, two years running. Yeah. So, any other like swimming teams? Yeah. Oh, yeah, we won swimming as well. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Swimming. yeah. yeah. Yes. Yeah. So for consecutively, how many years? Sooning, uh, I think uh, uh, two years, at least minimum yeah. two years if I'm not wrong. The next major one should be um, the Asian Uni, A Asian University Water Polo <laughs> Championships. Yeah, and um, it'll be experience for us, like, cause it's our first, you know, like major event besides Great Eastern. Yeah, and uh, it's against countries like Japan and Uzbekistan, which is like whoa. So it's like eye opener for us, uh. mm. Uh, actually, for uh, Great Eastern, we are actually uh, emerged champions, lah. Yeah. Mm. What about Sunit? Sunit, it wasn't. It wasn't really a official formal competition. It was more of a exhibition. yeah exhibition to like like get the teams coming down so that they form teams and then we will have like a more official competition in coming years. Well, upcoming in like July, we actually have this Asian Uni Games. Where like countries like Korea, Japan, Pakistan, even yeah, coming down to NUS itself, you know, uh, from 8th to 14th July. So NUS is hosting this. Yeah, yeah we are hosting it. How confident are you? They are all tough teams, so right now we are still trying to do our best in training. Um, it's usually Tuesday and Thursdays training, but we have increased it to Mondays to Fridays, uh, in hope that you can match their strength and so the probably. Yes. yes. Catch water polo on Vox Box. Vox Sports. Believe it.